Hello, welcome back to my channel. Today I will share with you how to call a boss API to create a new country in weather app demo. So don't forget to subscribe my channel. Okay, let's start. the model for response when you call the create a new country API. Let's take a look at response when you call the API in Boxman. You say this is my API. I define my body is the name is Korea and flag is Korea. Don't forget to change this one to JSON and send. You see when I create a new country the bus end will return a response with success is true. So I will define the model it create country response and we will define the struct for this. Go to the model folders, right click and choose new file, then choose script file, create the file with the name A create country response. Okay, I will define the struct with the name A create country response. With the data type is decodable and the file here I will change to let success and boolean. Let's go to country service and write the function to call the boss API to create a new country. Country service here. I will create a new function to create a new country. So with the name E function create country. We will pass the country with the tie in the country. Country with the tie in country. Completion escaping. Then create a country response. Escaping closure will contain the data you will get back from the ABI. So to start writing the code, I will write the to do there. So you will know what we need to do. So I'm ready to do that. First, we are creating the URL with the ABI we want to call. We will set the request with the boss method and config the data to send to ABI. Create and start a networking pass to call the API. Number four, we will handle the result return from API. Okay, now we will start with step one. So we will continue with a step in review the API. Okay. First of all, we need to do gar net URL will be equal with the URL string I will attach the URL in the description so you can get it errors we will raise the error in valid URL okay step 2 we will declare the request so var request will be echo with the URL continue we will request dog http method we will let them know okay, the boss methods okay request dog add value this will be the application json json here is the content card request dog http body we will try json we need to encode it what we send sending out okay then we will do the step 3. We will call the data task from the URL session. URL session dot share of data task with the URL will be the request. Click closure will return the data response and the errors. Then we need to do the reason here. Okay, in the last step. The step 4. At the step 4, we need to handle the result written from the API. We continue to do our net data will be echo with the data and when the error echo with new else, this part Q main dot async. Then completion with the new and return.
if have the data and nothing errors, we will continue to let's create entry response and try JSON decode then type create country dot or create country response dot cell and the data from the data. Okay. View dot main dot async and completion with the create country response. Okay, done. So I will delete this one. Okay, great. We finished the file country service to handle the calling box API. Next, we will go to the view model and create a new file to handle the Ask country view model. Okay, go to the view model folder and create a new file. Select the script file and create the file with name is R country view model. Now we will continue create class R country view model with the data type A observate object. When you create a new country, what we need? We need a country name, right? So I will declare the name a string and the default value a empty string. Let's define a new function with the name a add country to call the create country from the country service. Bar country name with a string. The country name will be echo with the cell dot name dot lowercase. Okay. I always lowercase before I send to the service. Next country will be echo with the country name. Country name. Black. A the country name dot tree name. Writer and one space new line. Private bar country service. Now I can call the country service. Sell dot country service dot create country with the country a country. We don't need get any data when create country success, so let's let them. Oh, sorry, here should be the country name. Okay, you see the error here. So we define the initializer function here. Cell country service be equal with country service. Let's hit the reason button to relock the thing. This thing does. Okay. Now I want to add the one text field here. So when I type in the country, when I click the add button, it will add the new country. Let's go to the add country view. What I really want to do here, I want to add the name of the country in the text field to create a new country. Add a new country basically managed by add country view model. So for the first thing I need to do is I need to initialize the view model. So I will do observate check private bar add country view model echo with add country view model. Okay. Now I will add a form and the form will include the session with the header in the country name. So go on to the base stack. So I will define the form with the session the test country. Okay, then inside I will need the test field that holder is enter name. Okay. The test will be echo with cell dot country vm. Name. We assign the value from text field to the name of the add country view model. So when you hit the add button there, it will be called the add country from the add country view model. Go to listing, go to create, add the name. Okay, this one, uh, maybe we need to run on the emulator to, to test thing. Let's start the. Okay, I'm starting. Building on the emulator and then see the result. Okay, go to the listing. Refresh no country. I will create a new country. Enter the name. I will add the name in Taiwan. Refresh no countries. Okay. Let's check the code again and figure out why 
Mm, okay, I see. I know why. Because I have an art, an action to add the country in the add button. Now we will add the action here. So the add country, we will do for the add country. Okay, let's test again. I will open simulator. Go to listing. And then tap on the add button. Then we add country name in Taiwan. Okay, now tap on the refresh button. Yeah, now you see it show the Taiwan. Yeah, we finished the topic for today. So you can know how you can make the boss API in the Swift UI. In the next video, I will show you the new topic, how you can click on the each country to get the weather detail for each countries. Okay, thank you for watching my video. In the next video, I will show you how you can tap on each country and we show the detail of the weather don't forget to subscribe my channel thank you and see you in the next video